Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. I just made this video yesterday on this and somebody questioned it, how he drew that inner ring. And they questioned it right because I did not draw that, but I know how he drew it. You can see the bounding box from the Gussie and Blur. So let's take an ellipse and let's hit P, put it in the center of the page. Let's make it a um, hundred points. And if that number's not in there, you can just type in a hundred points. Made it, I'm going to make it that blue. And then, well, what I should have done, back up here. Let me, before I'm bit it big, I need to know the size. I am going to, let's make it 20 inches with a ratio locked. That's one thing I wish Krill would do is make that lock a little bigger. Let's control D and make a duplicate and let's move it out of the way. I think I made, yeah, I made two copies. Now let's take this, go up to your pen tool and I want to go 100 points, but I want it in that blue. There's a lot going on in my computer because all this, you know, what if I deleted that, that might help. There we go. Now make this one light green and let's make it, and your pen tool should be up. I've got so many up there. Let's make it a 50 points. Well, let's, that's too big. Let's make it a 30, 30 points. And now let's hit P, put it in the center of the page. That one is selected. The last thing you have selected is always selected. Then go to effects, blur. And I like blurring it while it's on its, um, on the other uh, color so you can really see it. And we're gonna, because you can blur the, wow, that didn't look good at all. Yeah, there we go. You know what? It looks like it's blurring them both. Let me, um, See, I've got the blue selected. Let's go up to effects and blur and Gussie. Yes, it was blurring both of them, I think. So I've got it a little bit too much, so I'm gonna back off a little bit. And what it does, it gives it kind of a neon rounded corner, like, a, like it's a hollow or a tube of something. That's a pretty cool design. And while I've got you here, control G to group it, control D to duplicate it, I'm beginning, I'm wondering whether you can interlock these two because of the gussie and blur. I'm beginning to think maybe you can't. Uh, let's take a rectangle. Just make sure you get all four corners. We're going to grab the rectangle, which we have selected. We're going to grab that. No, it won't let you do it because of the gussie and blur. There is a way to un underlock that, but uh, not with a gussie and blur already done. That's pretty cool. And my hat's off to the young man that came up with that. Uh, there's a lot you could do with that. Hope that helped. Thank you for watching.